A potential break in the case tonight of two deadly shootings less than a mile apart in Wissanoming. One of the victims, a well-liked mechanic. A person is now in custody who police say may be connected to both crimes. Our Greg Argos is at police headquarters tonight with the new details in the investigation. Greg? And Yuki, police sources say that person may have been a witness to the first shooting and a person of interest in the second. A Friday night pursuit near Cottage and Bridge Streets. The male looks at him, jumps in a car and takes off at a high rate of speed. Leads to the arrest of two people, at least one of whom may be connected to two deadly shootings, including the killing of a popular Wissanoming mechanic. As part of our review of uh, video surrounds in the area, the vehicle was one that uh, we took notice of. Investigators say this vehicle was seen around the 4700 block of Benner Street Thursday around 3 in the afternoon when shots rang out between what police say are two groups of drug dealers. Mike G. Hey, baby! 56-year-old Mike Gleba, a longtime resident of the area and owner of this auto shop, was struck by a stray bullet while working on this white SUV about a block from the shootout. He died after being rushed to a nearby hospital. About an hour later, just a half mile away on the 5500 block of Torsdale, another shooting, one dead. The same car involved in Friday's chase spotted in that area, according to investigators. Police sources say the driver may be connected to that second homicide as well. It was a car we just took notice to being in and around the area of the murder of 5537 Tarsdale yesterday. So. Um, when he also saw the car, he recognized it right away and just wanted to have a conversation with the gentleman who took off. Uh, but now because he crashed into his car, he's going to be uh, charged. Now at this hour, we're told detectives are still questioning that driver. His name has not been released. I'm live here at police headquarters, Greg Argos, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Greg, thanks. And